Are you thinking about visiting Turkey? Or maybe you've already booked your flight and you are looking for inspiration. After three years of traveling around the world, we now call this amazing country home. Naturally, we could talk for hours about why you should visit Turkey, but in the interest of time, we will try and keep this list as short as possible. We have put together our top seven reasons why Turkey should be the next country you visit. So let's get started with number one. Number one is the beautiful nature and unique landscapes of Turkey. Being a large country, Turkey has a lot of variety for those in search of nature. If you have spent any time researching Turkey, you've probably already seen the otherworldly images of Cappadocia with its unique rock formations, cave hotels, and hundreds of hot air balloons that fill the sky each morning. Or the Cotton Castle of Pamukkale with its white travertine terraces filled with steaming hot natural spring water. Turkey also has the lush green highlands where much of the country's tea is grown, and you have the white-capped Mount Ararat, the site where Noah's Ark is said to have landed. Of course, when you're talking about the natural beauty in Turkey, you also have the amazing coastline, which is reason enough to visit. So that brings us to number two, the amazing beaches and coastline in Turkey. Turkey has roughly 8,300 kilometers of coastline with some incredible seaside towns. The turquoise coast located between Antalya and Izmir is by far the most popular section and for very good reason. Sure, you can enjoy a relaxing seaside holiday here and lay out on some amazing beaches surrounded by cliffs, but if you're like me and can't sit on a beach for much more than 10 minutes, we promise there is plenty to do here that will keep you busy. You can go scuba diving in Kosh, take a short boat ride to one of the nearby Greek islands, you could go paragliding in one of the best paragliding locations in the entire world, or admire thousands of years of history that is present all along this coastline. The options are seriously endless. When talking about the coast, there are many options to choose from, and you could probably spend hours watching YouTube videos trying to decide where to go. Or you could let us help you. We have created a comprehensive digital guide to Turkey that you should not come here without. If you're interested in learning more about this, just go to the link in the description or the pinned comments. Okay, back to our list and our personal favorite area of the coast, which is the section between Antalya and Fethiye. You have so much to choose from on this section of coast. Whether you are looking for scenic coastal drives, white sandy beaches surrounded by cliffs, or ancient ruins surrounded by the sea, you can find it here. Turkey's coastline is certainly one of the main reasons to consider visiting. You can find incredible beaches, amazing accommodation, and plenty of adventure with less tourists and at a lower cost than some of Turkey's neighbors like Greece or Italy. And that brings us to the third reason why Turkey should be your next holiday destination, which is the value you get for your money here. You should visit Turkey because it is affordable. Everything from accommodation, transportation, and the incredible food, what you get for your money here in Turkey is hard to beat anywhere else in the world. There are cheaper destinations, but very few can beat the value that you get for your money here in Turkey. If you're anything like us and you like to keep track of your budget, then traveling to a low-cost destination creates so much freedom. Your money goes much further, which allows you to say yes to even more experiences. You might even be able to stretch your travel plans for much longer than you could somewhere else. Something else that goes along with the value for your money here, so let's call it 3.1, would be the quality and the ease of travel within the country. Turkey is a very big country, so if you do plan to visit, chances are you're going to be covering some serious ground. Luckily, this shouldn't impact your budget too much. Istanbul has not just one, but two major international airports, making it easy to find inexpensive and even direct flights from almost anywhere in the world. And Turkey has a number of high quality and affordable domestic carriers, making it easy to cover large distances within the country. For example, you could fly from Istanbul to Cappadocia for as low as $40 one way per person. If you happen to have more time and are interested in driving or taking the bus, that's great too. The roads are very nice and easy to navigate in Turkey. Okay, on to number four, which has to be the incredibly picturesque towns. As you travel around Turkey, you will find yourself in awe at just how picturesque so many of the towns are. You have a Mazara along the Black Sea coast with a beautiful harbor and a tiny island connected to the mainland with a stone arched bridge. There is Saffron Bolu filled with Ottoman style homes that jut out over the cobblestone streets. In the highlands region, there are small villages like Pokud set high in the mountains that often seems to be floating on a sea of clouds. In the southeast, you have the ancient city of Mardin with beautiful stone architecture complete with a castle on top of the hill overlooking Mesopotamia. 
And hidden in the hills, just a few minutes from the famous site of Ephesus, you can stroll through the steep alleyways of Syringe and admire the many whitewashed stone homes. There are dozens of other picturesque towns all along the famous turquoise coast. There is Salimie, Bodrum, Alachati, Cheshme, and the list goes on and on. And of course, we cannot forget about the many, many picturesque neighborhoods just right here in Istanbul. Moving right along, number five is the history and culture here in Turkey. If for nothing else, you should visit Turkey for the incredibly rich culture and history here. I really feel like you could close your eyes, put your finger on a map of Turkey, and it will land within a pretty short distance of what should be a UNESCO World Heritage Site if it isn't already one. So much of the world's history can be traced back to the land within the borders of Turkey. Whether we're talking about Mesopotamia and the historical monuments that date back 12,000 years to the beginning of civilization, or some of the greatest empires in history, you will find it in Turkey. This land has changed hands between the Greek, Persian, Roman, and Ottoman empires, and you will find history and cultural influences from each of these great empires throughout the country. If you like history and you have not been to Turkey, you should book a flight right now and experience this incredible history for yourself. Or I guess you could just read a book about it. Fun fact, books were actually invented here in Turkey too. Anyway, before we lose some of you to too much history, let's move on to the food. Number six is the incredible food. Turkey is the bridge between Europe and Asia, and the mix of cultures has created a very impressive and unique cuisine. Turkey is very proud of their food, and that is for good reason. I think there are over 100 different types of kebabs, so as I am sure you can imagine, there is no shortage of delicious grilled meats. And with over 8,000 kilometers of coastline, the seafood is incredibly fresh and delicious. Sitting down at a mehane for mezes and raki is an experience in itself, and a Turkish breakfast is basically like an event. A few of our other favorite dishes include pide, manti, guzleme, borek, dolma, honestly, we could keep going for days, and you also have an amazing list of different desserts, with our personal favorite being baklava. A great way to experience the food culture in Turkey is to do a food tour in Istanbul. Istanbul is the perfect place to try the many unique regional specialties that come from all over the country. While on a food tour, you can try things you might never order yourself and learn things like how to properly enjoy a delicious cup of Turkish coffee without eating it. Fun fact, the very first coffee shop in the world opened right here in Istanbul around 500 years ago, and the coffee culture is still very much so alive today. If you're looking for even more caffeine, you can really drink like the locals and try Turkish tea. It is by far the most popular drink in all of Turkey. Turks drink more tea per capita than any other country in the world and they love to share. One of the most common displays of the incredible hospitality in this country is a genuine offer to sit down for a cup of tea. This brings us to our final reason why you have to visit Turkey. Last but certainly not least are the people and the warm hospitality. One of the first things you'll notice when you arrive in Turkey is the kindness and respect that is offered to guests of this country. A guest is viewed as a gift from God and you will feel that throughout your visit in Turkey. Even Istanbul, one of the biggest and busiest cities in the world, is a very welcoming place. People will go out of their way to help you. And I can't even count the number of times we have been invited to sit and enjoy tea by complete strangers simply to chat. So if none of our other reasons to visit Turkey have sold you yet, you must come witness the incredible hospitality. Okay, now that you're sold on Turkey, let us help you plan the perfect trip. As I'm sure you can tell, we absolutely love this country, and we want to give you the best chance to fall in love with this place just like we have. So much more goes into planning a great trip than just what you're going to see and do. And it can take hours to find good information online and determine what's actually gonna help you plan your trip. We have spent months and months putting the best information together in a format that is easy to digest. And we provide itinerary examples for one, two, and three weeks. So click the link in the description or the pinned comments, get our guide, and start planning your trip to Turkey. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any of our upcoming turkey videos. Come to Turkey!